Welcome to the speedboat. Yay, yeah, speedboats! This is part four of restoring a classic 1977 Sea Rider SR4 speedboat. This episode's about the dashboard. This is the old patch on the dashboard, so I'm using this as a template to make my new template. I, I got the stuff. You got the plastic? It's outside against the wall. Gonna make the remake this transom plate from recycled plastic. What's the plastic made of, Tiago? <laughs> uh, yogurt cups. It's made from yogurt pots. Uh, yeah. Oh, this is when it's lighter. He has less uh, color. Mm, it's like it does, the, less. It's like you see, the the other one was very bluish. Yeah. But this one is very just white. So yeah. you never know what you're gonna get. It's different bits no. of yogurt pots. No, yeah. It's the perfect thing for your dash. Yeah. So here's the dashboard. There must be like, what, a thousand yogurt pots in this, basically. Yogurt pot. All modern ribs have a rubbing strake around the edge of the tubes, which is basically a rubber sort of fender protector system, which means you can bump into things. Sorry. So this is a new uh, rubbing strake. This is a new bit of protective rubber that's going to go around the edge of the old tubes, like that. Nice. Look at that. It's going to look classy. Getting a suit on. Look at that, that's great. So this is what we're probably going to need on our big trip, actually. That's a full waterproof suit. Uh, yes. It's a good look. <laughs> this is a real treat because we're getting to go out in Bill's boat. A nice hood as well. Oh yeah. Look at Never that. Never use the hood. Going out in Bill's boat, this is very civilized. Guess of the water temperature? Oh, have you got a gauge? Yeah. 8.7 8. 8. 8. degrees in the water. Oh. Bill, this is bigger than uh, my boat, isn't it? it what's yours? Is four. Four meter, yeah. yeah four point three. Is it? Five point eight five. Five point eight five meters. Yeah. So Bill's rib is nearly six meters long. Ours is only four meters. But um, from what I can tell, it's not about size. It's about what you can do with it and how many gadgets you've got on the dashboard. Moment three. Nice. You just need to grab from yeah. Very nice. It's not very symmetric though. <laughs> that my template isn't very symmetrical. What do you think? Yeah. I mean, 
Symmetrical was never my strong point. It looks great. Well, you did a pretty good job with that template. <laughs> so there's the old one, that's the old transom plate. And here's the new one. Oh, Bang. look at that. It's really nice. Well done. Well, thanks, Tiago. That's great. Steering is in, so now we can work out where we actually want this stuff. Maybe we can get the radio in here. This is taking a long time, but we are actually sort of turning a corner now. My favourite thing is gadgets, and that's what's going in now. GPS, depth sounder, VHF radio, rubber ducky on the one nine. So should I start her up? Yeah. In neutral. Here we go. Lovely. 4,000 RPM, here we go. So I try and... turns nest over there in the summer. This is the hot site for bird watching. I say so, yeah. So we're just out doing some bird watching here. We come out to this very quiet little spot where the birds like to hang out. I think they were red shanks. Yeah. Yeah, he's having a look around. I've just seen a seal. So you get a lot of seals really around here, don't you? Yeah, you get quite a few. Are they kind of, do you think they like it around here? The dashboard has this handle on, um, for obvious reasons, when you're going over waves. As a passenger, you need a handle. It's a little bit knackered, but I'm going to um, polish it.
This is now all sanded and the glue is going on. Right, this is the moment of truth. Right, finally doing the wiring. Um, I'm trying to keep calm and do this as reliably as possible. So we've got the fuse box here. Um, we've got Rove's fuses in here, which should hopefully stop things from uh, catching fire. This is the two switch panels. Wiring is all complete. Um, are you here to see a speedboat by any chance? <laughs> yes. Speedboat. Yes, that's the fuse box. Is it it's live? Pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. You, no, it's not live. What do you think of speedboats? Do you like speedboats? Solid. This is good safety inspection. <laughs> That's the steering wheel. Now down here we've got the GPS. So that's how you know where you're going. There we go. It's found where we are. And then this is the depth gauge. Just so you know how deep the water is. So this is going to give us all our depth. And then here we've got the VHF radio. So you can talk into that. Hello, hello. Worried it's going to blow up. Charlie, look. Basically, I want to change the angle of this so that the steering wheel's a bit higher. But I'm going to have a gap here. What would I do about that? Uh, I reckon you need a, a 3D printed part fit uh, fit perfectly. Do you know anyone with a 3D printer? Well, as it happens, uh, we've got one. And, uh, happy to print that for you. Oh, that would be incredible. Thank you very much. Can you do that now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll drop out <laughs> Getting this window in is really tricky. 